I'm going back to uh, the promised land, California. I lost my voice from Playlist Live. <coughs> <Time. coughs> well, I'm going to Houston. Everyone's starting to part of the airport. Security. It's so weird. I feel like I have to be quiet because I'm doing anything. to think I'm crazy. If I'm talking to a camera like by myself, like the actual real thing of what's really going on, like this guy on my shoulder is staring at me, he's like, what the hell is this guy doing? Kaylin Morelli made a new video. Uh, you should go check it out. It's pretty good. It's him doing a, like a poetry rap about uh, you know being an artist in the magic world. Now. Uh, <laughs> any magic trick that I do is marketed effects, so like I'm not I'm all, at the same time I never claim to really like be a magician. So I don't think that he's, I don't think he's calling me out, maybe he is, maybe he's not, but Kaylin and I are like cool with each other, we're buddies, and I think what, I think the video he did is cool, you guys should check it out, I'll we'll leave a link in the description to it, or just go to his YouTube channel, just search Kaylin Morelli, his YouTube channel will pop up, but uh, it's like a, like a freestyle like rap uh, like towards uh, magicians who are uh, essentially like buying magic tricks and just like performing them without really like performing them. They're just kind of like learning the trick and then going out and like performing it because like they know the method behind the trick as opposed to the actual performance art of magic. So check that out and let me know what you guys think about what he was saying in it and make sure to give him comments and let him know what you think about it too because I'm sure a lot of you might feel that he is challenging you in a way which is good you know you should all feel like challenged in some way because uh all the tricks that Kalen usually performs are his own ideas and his own thoughts and some variation of uh, a method that at the end of the day he still like came up with so uh, that's basically what he's trying to tell you guys to do so but leave a comment you know let me know whether twitter or whatever i'm about to hop on this flight see what we got up in this mug but someone on Twitter was telling me that oh people people think oh there we go hello sorry I didn't know you guys were bored in uh, number C yes thank you thank you people on Twitter were just saying like oh everyone thinks Caleb Morelli's a douchebag now but he just made a video come on now Sound like he was going around grabbing girls' asses. Okay, once again, shortly after departure, we'll begin serving complimentary Jesus coffee and soft drinks. Did she get that back now? Time now to make sure that your portable electronic devices are in airplane mode. You may have them on now for taxi, takeoff, cruise, and landing. Just make sure it's in airplane or game mode. Now, larger devices like airplane all laptop game? computers. Oh, here's a safety information card. If you go to a fast food restaurant, you'll just be able to stick your tongue out and it's going to like buy your taste buds, recognize like, all right, they'll like this and they'll just make your food. So playlist was pretty cool. I, uh, I did some indulging met some fun people met some got to hang out with friends and stuff like that i didn't meet as many people as i thought i was going to i was thought i was going to like work hard and show a bunch of people magic trick but i got there and i kind of like froze up i was just like i don't know if i want to be doing magic right now it just felt like i don't know i heard what are they gonna think of me you know i was just like are they just gonna think like oh he's just showing us magic because he wants to tell him about his YouTube channel. <laughs> or they're gonna be like, oh wow, cool, a magician, you know? So there's always that like connotation, that negative stigma in my mind that comes with being a magician or performing magic. But, so I was just like, you know, I'm just gonna hang out with Steve and Jeff and 
and uh, Matt G124 and some friends and try to enjoy a, enjoy the festivities that is Playlist Live. Please. <laughs> Driving back to LAX 40 minutes earlier than they expected, so Martha will be happy. Hi, baby. Driving to uh, the baggage claim type area, pick me up area, please. Oh, yeah, can you shop? I'm, I'm walking, I'm off the airplane, I'm walking to the baggage claim area. No, I said I'm walking to the bag. I said ba I'm walking to the bat. No, I said I'm walking to the baggage claim area. Driving to uh, the baggage claim type area. Why? Where, where are we going to go? Las Vegas? What's an Uber discount? Can we get the cat name of Mr. Biggles Worthless and have him just. Okay. <laughs> and he'll, he won't do anything, he'll just lay around, he's worthless. He's like, what are you good for, Mr. Briggles, worthless? Oh yeah. I've lost right. my voice. Uh, it would have been a lot better, that delivery. But as you can tell, my delivery. voice is <laughs> As you can tell, my voice is kind of cold. It's yeah. not that bad, but I can make it bad. Should I just like try to go yes. as far left as possible? Yes. Follow that car right there. I don't know. I thought I was just going to go to five because I already passed seven. Oh. Uh, um, so what's the game plan? Drop your little bitch ass off so I can go live my life. I'm glad you're back. <laughs> I'm glad I'm back too. Yeah, you missed your bed, didn't you? I missed you. Please. Please, I don't buy it. <laughs> ah! <laughs> oh. <laughs> No, it's not like that between us. Put it in drive and just let your car gradually slow down. That was a good catch. Home at last, home at last. Thank God I'm home at last. Nigga, 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 nigga. Wow. What up? Where are the boys? Everyone's gone. Except for Steve. So just Alex is <laughs> Hi, Steve. You made it back. There he is. Here's the boy. Bring it in. Bring it in. You watching Better Call Saul or have you watched it yet? I, I already watched it. It was really good. It was good. Did you watch it, Colton? I want to watch it, yeah. I was watching The Big Bang Theory, and then I was watching Shark Tank, and then I was watching The Simpsons, and then I was watching TMZ, and then I was watching Modern Family so first. Guess... Modern Family is really funny. But it's stupid because they're like, we'll give you... Free TV shows to pick whatever episode you want to watch. And then you go to click it and stuff, and they're like, oh, you actually need this plugin to install. Yeah, I saw. With Southwest? Yes. I wish flights would charge $10 more per person and then just have free Wi Fi. <laughs> yeah. I think that's exactly So instead of it being like $410, it's just $420. Like, you wouldn't know the difference. Yeah, right. Like, whatever. Hidden fees? Fine. <laughs> like, I just don't want to know I'm paying for it. Want Wi-Fi to be featured on your... Do you want Wi-Fi to be featured, like, in your purchase? <laughs> and then you just click it. It's like an add-on bonus feature. 
and then it's just like an extra nine dollars as a part of your total because what's nine dollars compared to four hundred and fifteen dollars nothing you're just still explaining it Back in Michigan, who? 